I'm going to show you two tips on how to move ground and building blocks more efficiently while saving extra time running around. Depending on the terrain you are working on, you're going to need a tiny stockpile, small stockpile and a cart. Now this is not only a tip for beginners because I've also seen advanced users still making the same mistake when they start off a new world or they start off on a new terrain where they would like to build a house or a factory or anything like that. So I have found a nice little spot here at the water, it is very peaceful, there are some fish swimming around and I would like to build a tiny little house down here, but as you can see there is a lot of ground down here and I would like to move it up to some other spot. Now what most people will do is they will take the shovel, they will shovel some ground and choose a spot somewhere out there where they would like to drop it out of the way. So for example right down here. Now I'm going to need to run forwards and backwards, forwards and backwards. This will cost a lot of time. So what can we do in order to progress this a lot faster we can make use of stockpiles because once you shovel your shovel into a stockpile you grab 10 dirt at a time and you have to run around way lesser what we also want to do is make sure that the stockpile is as close to the place where you want to remove the dirt so you also don't have to run around to your stockpile all the time so there is here a nice tiny little spot for a tiny stockpile so I'm going to place this tiny stockpile down here and now I can just shovel and drop, shovel and drop and I'm going to do this a few couple of times and all I have to do is just move to the side in order to drop it down there and I don't have to run around to some other unknown spot where I have to drop all the dirt so now that the stockpile is all the way filled up I'm just going to drop this down here because I don't want to run around extra now from this side I'm going to empty the stockpile with 10 dirt at a time and I'm just going to dump drop it right down here until my shovel is empty. After that make sure your stockpile is empty too. Now that the tiny stockpile is empty we can remove it because now we can place a small stockpile which can help a lot more dirt. Now let's pretend that we actually don't want to drop the dirt right down here but much further away in this case you can actually use a cart you just drop this cart down here and it works the same as a stockpile you just shovel some dirt and drop it onto the cart and on a cart you can drop down a lot more dirt and also the further you get you can also move your cart closer when you feel like to so you have to turn around way lesser or walk around way lesser you just pick it up move it a bit closer and you fill it up all the way and so when the cart is full you can just pick it up and move it to a destination of your liking in order to dump drop your dirt for example right down here then we're going to put our shovel into the cart and then we get 10 dirt at a time and then we can easily drop it down here without having to run around forwards and backwards to our digging site now i'm going to show you how to move building blocks more efficiently without running around for way too much Normally you would go to your vehicle or your stockpile, you would go to the storage, you would take a little bit of your building materials, then you would run around on your building site to a second floor, third floor, fourth floor or whatever it is that you would like to place your building blocks. And after you've been placing your building blocks, you would go run around all the way downstairs again in order to pick up some more of these. And on this way it will cost a lot of time going forwards and backwards up and down. Now I'm going to show you a more efficient way of doing so. All you're going to need is a chest. This chest you're going to place on the floor where you want to build. You place it right down here. You're going to go into the inventory. You scroll down to your stockpile or vehicle that contains your building blocks. You're going to move it over to your hands. And on this way you don't have to run upstairs or downstairs all the time. And also not to forget you can grab your actual stockpile and move it all the way up to the list. So when you go out and in again. Your stockpile will be straight on top this will save you scrolling down a lot now if you would like to have some more tips and tricks on eco or you would like to see my gameplay on eco check out my channel for more videos